let's reflect briefly on, on Brentford. A crazy game, the right result, and, and you got the winner. I'm sure everyone was over the moon. Yeah, that's, uh, what I said is just uh, yeah, we started very well, and we, and I think the, after 20 minutes we, we didn't play well. They created a lot of chance, so we could they could easily score three or four times. But we, but yeah, we changed the uh, we changed the game in 50 minutes, and yeah, we were very happy with that. wasn't was <laughs> was a crazy game, but uh, in the end we collected points, and we were very happy with it. Yeah. And you don't often get this situation where you know you're about to score that goal because like you know the ball was rolling goalwards and you, all you had to do was apply that finish. Uh, I suppose you knew, you knew quite a long time in advance it was going. Yeah, in. because when the keeper uh, came out and he touched it wrong, I knew already I have to uh, just run forward and hopefully uh, Jan will will yeah will will shoot it uh, on the goal on target and yeah I, I was there, Danny was there, but I was happy I was the first one there. Yeah. And, and we've mentioned already the character of this team so many times, and, and and again, I think in that difficult circumstance, it was so good good to see the team, uh, you know, coming out on top. Yeah, I think that, that's the, that's the thing about our team. Uh, we, we, uh, you now, the last couple of weeks, we changed a lot of uh, in system and, uh, and players, and uh, uh, yeah, but everybody uh, stays positive, stays behind the way how we want to do it, and also if we if we are uh, um, like against uh, Brentford, we are 2-1 uh, two, uh, two behind and we, we change the game. I think that's the, you, you can only do it uh, if you, are, uh, you stick together and you be positive. Yeah? And on a personal level too, you had to make that impact as a substitute. And I know every player wants to play every minute of the game, but it's, it's, sometimes you have to be patient or, or, or rest your legs sometimes as well yeah. when, when need be and, and be ready to make those impacts. Yeah, that's, that's how it is. Also, not only for me, also for Jan and uh, for, for George. Uh, of course, everybody wants to play. And uh, for, uh, if the cafe asks me uh, how I feel, I will, I will tell him that I, I'm ready, uh, uh, ready to play. And, uh, but he made the decisions, and uh, also for for everybody. And uh, yeah, if you get your minutes, you have to you have to do it. And till so far, we played that we played already uh, 30 games. So sometimes it's good to have uh, have a break. Yeah, and of course, you've, it's another goal to the tally. I think that's seven for you this season. Yeah. One of which came against uh, Huddersfield at the start of the year. You know, we played yeah. again this weekend. You got the winner there again against them. So uh, would, would be uh, would be very nice. And my my goal my main goal was to 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 score 10 goals this season and uh, yeah, I'm still uh, still going there, so hopefully I can uh, continue on, uh, on Tuesday. It, it's been, a, I suppose, for a player who plays in those attacking positions, you know, you want the team to win, but it's good to be able to contribute in that way and you certainly, you know, found your feet in front of the goal, yeah. Yeah, the, uh, that's how it is. Uh, sometimes, the, the thing is, sometimes you play a very good, uh, very good match and you, you, don't, you don't score. Uh, yeah, you just want to, you, you just want to bring in equality, and uh, I'm not a, like a top scorer, goal getter, but I score my goals and yeah, just uh, help the team.